We aren't cooks. But we do create food like meat from plants and fungi and it's often so realistic that you can't even tell it's not real meat. We love meat. But we do know that it's crucial for us and our future for us to reduce the meat intake. Did you know that we already produce enough food to beat the world? Yet, food security is still an issue in many countries. More than 30% of farmland is used to grow crops to feed livestock. Imagine how much more food we would have if we fed these crops to people instead. At ASAR, we aim to improve the taste and texture of plant-based food products so that more people will incorporate plant-based foods in their diets. Examples include vegetarian versions of whole muscle meat like chicken breast and layered meat products like pork belly. I'm Simi. And I'm Li Min. We are in the food process engineering team here at ASTAR and we are primarily looking at the texturization of proteins. A key technology that we use here is actually extrusion processing and especially high moisture extrusion. So why this is interesting is because it actually allows us to turn plant proteins into products that have similar textures to meat. I've always been very fascinated by the technology used to produce the food that we eat every day. And when I learned that it was a potential career pathway when I was 15, I decided to pursue an education in food science and technology. And later on, I joined the industry and I've never looked back ever since. The need for healthy, affordable and tasty food has never been more important. I've always aspired to create such products. Using our food science knowledge, we are recreating sustainable versions of foods we love, like chicken rice with plant-based chicken. People are always really puzzled whenever I say that I'm a food technologist. They seem to think that I can cook really well, but actually, I can't cook. Food is so familiar, but wondrously complex and difficult to study. There are so many areas you can choose to specialise in like texture, flavour, nutrition, and more. There are many ups and downs in research, but it's always quite satisfying when you find something new or come up with a new process that works. The world of food science and technology is so complex and so fascinating. I feel that anyone who's interested should really come and join us.